Owry. Owry. This is gonna hurt. I mean, maybe it'll hurt them. You know, if I win the coin toss. And make six uh, six blocks against armor seven, but probably not. The block three dicing snotlings and frenzying snotlings is going to be horrific. Yeah, game's crashing. Crazy. Rating of 7 out of 10 is, is pretty good, all things considered. Oh, it is. I should just put Legendary Edition. Do not play this game if you plan to just... Oh my god! Game freezes randomly. Yeah. Um, do you know what's uh, Do you know what's fantastic though? <laughs> oh yeah, of course, of course. He got the. Uh, of course, he won the toss. Just a waste of time now, this man. That is the uh, the problem with ogres. I might as well just concede; it'll be easier. But um, <laughs> this is brilliant. Check this out. Check this review out. Do not play this game if you plan to just play against the AI. It cheats a lot by rolling miracle dice rolls that ruin your game at the very beginning. No skill whatsoever. <laughs> oh man, that's unbelievable, isn't it? Unbelievable. Yeah, they are. They are new ogres. Yeah, yeah. I bought the. I bought this. I bought the uh, purple, the Mr. Blobby outfits for them. Oh, this is just gonna be a massacre, isn't it? Because he's got he's got blocking everybody, so it's just gonna be. He's got Norse. They're armor seven. I won't break armor ever. <laughs> I've played enough Norse to know that I will never break the armor of a Norseman. As long as I live on this planet, I will never break the armor seven of a Norseman. <laughs> Straight into a frenzy trap. Just in care. And straight into a stone. Brilliant. Beautiful. Beautiful. Frenzy trap into a stone. That's setting the tone instantly for the way this game is going to go. Second frenzy trap. Let's see if he gets punished. Don't count on it. No, he hit a pal. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Um. Ah, uh, you can't aim for anything with ogres, can you? Just gotta. Just gotta see what happens. Just try and do something any way you can. There's no aiming for things. When you when your team's this fucking shit. Come on, skull it. Skull it, you motherfucker. Yes. Punished. At least in some way. I 
hair splitting him is fine. Oh, I could have made it three times, couldn't I? He's running, so he's more dangerous, isn't he? But I've got to block with him in case he goes stupid, so he wouldn't affect the other one. Sorry. Knew I should have dodged this this skink, this snotling first, goblet, nobbler, whatever they are. <laughs> I should have dodged him first. Because it's a 1 in 36 instead of a 1 in 9, isn't it? Unbelievable, the game must be bugged. I can't I can't understand what just happened. Yeah, negative review on Steam. <laughs> I cast, I cast a fucking Norse on turn two. What the fuck is happening? I don't think they do have a leopard print, but that would have been a good idea, wouldn't it? Yes, Eric Sal, they're probably worse. Fuck off, you cocksucker! 
Jesus fucking Christ. But especially, especially against Norse. There's, it's just an absolute pointless match, this. Because not only does he have block on everybody, he has frenzy on half of them. And it's just, it's just, and he's got Dauntless as well. It's just horrible. I had to win the toss and Kaz four people on turn one. To even stand a chance. Well, the problem is, is that it's not heart strength five half the time, is it? Because they're, they're fucking stupid half the time. He could blitz him, base the ball. He could go in there. Right. Nah, he just just done. Good lad. Fair enough. So he can block him, he can block him, he can block him. So he can move first. Safe moves first. Unbelievable, Jeff. No, I bet it's not far, I think. Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> Thank you. That's right, man. Is it the same ogre? Yeah, it was. <laughs> Two ogres, Max. <laughs> Yeah, if they had orc throwers, they'd actually be a hundred times better. Ogres really would be so good with orc throwers. That's not even a joke. Oh, wow, bad play. Should have, uh, should have... Pushed him into to block a thing, shouldn't he? Yeah, well, I, that's, maybe it's not bad play, but I, I don't, I didn't like it. Wow, he didn't bow him. Face the ball. Oh, you can't. Wow, oh, that's pretty annoying. That's why I don't take rerolls, you know, because you, you fail so many boneheads and like. So many other fucking random rolls. Having a reroll for all of this dumb shit that you're gonna do doesn't really matter too much, I don't think.
Oh, I could have double GFI'd him and hit the ball, couldn't I? Oh, that's snotling power. Get banged on, little shit. That's a knob one. It's not a snotling. Jimmy is so smart, new ogre thrower. Wow, unbelievable, G. Why are you not head developer on <laughs> this game? <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't know why. I should be. Could I hit the ball with a double GFI that would all get that? Oh no, I couldn't send the bitty that would all fall in. Block is a good skill, yeah, it's the best skill. <laughs> Uh, the thing is, though, I'm out. <laughs> it depends what you'd say because I would obviously just ban Dory instantly if I was the head developer. All the sweet data. Oh man, I really need to update that, don't I? <laughs> My personal dog. <laughs> Thanks. Fuck <laughs> off. <laughs> the sage one's amazing, isn't it? How fast are my goblins? Noblars. GFI. No, but he could go in there without a GFI. So... Yeah, but then I couldn't get in. Greed is good. Greed is right. Start off the turn with a GFI, yeah? Works. Didn't even fail. Unbelievable, Jack. Chain. Oh, he's got sack on turn side step off. <gasps> oh. Cyanide, please. For fuck's sake. So, you know, I could have chained him in and then two diced the ball. But of course not. So now my mass not only is just getting punched for no reason. No, you can't. Well, I don't know. Well, let's find out. You know, I don't want to even find out. Oh, yeah, okay, I'll find out. I guess I should have just done the block first, eh? Oh, yeah, okay. You can. <laughs> All right. You can't when you're going to get surfed, though. You can't when you're going to get surfed. Oh, well, there you go, then. Right. Because when I played Ducky, um, he put his guy in the corner... And he couldn't not use sidestep, so it's okay. So you, I was wrong. <laughs> oh well, thank you, Tom. Five thousand. I guess I should have tried first. I guess I should have tried just tried it first, eh? Because it wouldn't have been that bad if it hadn't worked, I guess. But then I had to do the standing up first. So I, yeah, no, I, I had to do it like that. Wow, he didn't kill him. 
Herp derp. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I am on the right. Burp, burp, burp. And that's pal naturally. It's funny being not very happy about losing with ogres, but I just fucking hate Norse. Like, why did it have to be Norse? If it had been any other team, <laughs> it wouldn't have been so bad, but why did it have to be Norse? Don't know what size of two. And then there, so that he, if he doesn't break armor, he can't go that way. Yeah, that's pretty. That was good sidestepping, wasn't it? That was good sidestepping. It's like Indiana Jones' fear of snakes. I like guys' fear of snotlings. <laughs> Fuckhead. Noblars, noblars. Must remember their noblars. Two. He could go there. You just stand with him. He can only block. He can block. Maybe get a pow. Got no reroll though. So maybe he has to stand up first and get punched. If he blocks, then there's two chances of freeing. The extra guy. Oh no, there you go. Double score. Guess that's what I should have saved my uh, reroll for. Right? Might have to be nice, yeah. Can't even side. Can't even surf a guy. I wish I'd save my reroll now. I didn't roll that double skulls. Obviously a pow, his guy would have been surfed, probably. Um. There you go. Great. Great. I wouldn't even feel bad losing with ogres normally, but fucking Norse. Norse, man. Oh, I hate them. He's gonna get surfed now, isn't he? Just poor friendly ogre. So we surfed his guy, got the ball, but oh no, had to double scores. Now one nil down. Olga cast. No, not not cast. It's actually taken no damage because obviously got the reserves. 
We've done some damage. So he's on 10 at max. So I might get a draw out of this. Oh, Ribcracker. You never know, might be able to score the one turn. Maybe, maybe get the one turn here. But it's hard, obviously, with moving five. Yeah, of course, it's still the same three fuckheads. But they cropped so you can't tell that they're all twins. <laughs> About a week starting. About a week. So they can make sure it's not bugged to hell. Yeah, it's a shame, isn't it, that it's just three random dudes that are all identical. It'd be really good if, like, Olgas, Olgas beat up the Norse that were served and Norse beat up the Olgas that were served. It'd be really good if you could do stuff like that. Like if Blizzard had got this or something, and uh, it would be really amazing, wouldn't it? Look at this will have to do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, of course. Alright, so at least try to make three dices first. Team already is nobblers, that's why they're fucking shit. I don't even know if there's a chance of scoring here, but I'll go for it. There you go. Rewarded. I've got to carry with an ogre now because everyone's got block. So it's too easy for him to get a too easy for him to get a snotling, isn't it? Art man eater. Kurg impatient. <laughs> I don't think an ogre would call somebody impatient, but there you go. Head splitter, yeah. Hairy, okay. Man eater, yeah, sure. Reaver, well, maybe not. Mad, yeah. This <laughs> just one impatient. Impatient ogre. <laughs> the man eater has to get it, doesn't he?
No, they haven't fixed the they haven't fixed the thing yet, of course, no. Three dice people. Good. Safe moves first. Got it with Ogres, haven't you? Ogres are a good team to play, I think, to like, you know, play good blood bowl. Just because they're so bad and you've got to make sure you do safe moves, moves first and stuff. Kind of. I guess there, so we can't get through as easily. Go for a blot with him. Yes, foul. <laughs> it's hard to even foul them as well. Because your snotlings are always dropping like flies. And you need numbers on the pitch, don't you? Even if they're strength one. Maybe I should have fouled him like the last turn of the half, but you just need eleven men, don't you? Even if five of them are shit. Hello, in Harry. Jay from Jin Sam. No, this is open. This is open. No. No, Tony. <laughs> Would you would you believe it didn't break an arm? Imagine getting banged on by a snot on you.
Yeah, the gun, hey, it's very, uh, it's very bugged, the revs leave, yeah. Yeah, it's really shit. You get star player points, and you get people resurrected and stuff. Yeah, it depends on your definition are really pretty bad, I wouldn't say. I mean, they're still elves, aren't they, at the end of the day? Even if they're the worst elves. Which, I think high elves are the worst elves. But, you know, some people might think pro elves are the worst elves. But even if they're the worst elves, they're still elves. <laughs> so they're still, they're still a good team. They're just a bit, um, you know, they're just, uh, they're just a bit... Not fantastic. Dodging away from snotlings. How bad would you feel? Well, because because dark elves are better and Wood elves are better, and people might think high elves are better. Leaving these guys here is fine because at least at least they've got their tackle zones currently. He's keeping that lineman tied up, but then he's so slow it means he shouldn't. Yeah, the, the, obviously the linemen are the worst in the pro elves, which is a big hit, but, you know, the, their catchers are really good, and their blitzers are really good. Their blitzers are better than high elf blitzers and dark elf blitzers, aren't they? They're just not as good as Wardens'. Well, I mean, Wood Elves have an AV7 line, or don't they? So, like, the big guy, and and some people, although most people use a tree, most good coaches use a tree, there's some that don't. And they're still not bad without a tree. They're not bad without a tree, Woodies. So, I don't know. I think High Elves are probably worse. Just because High Elves... Or like in between Wood Elves and Dark Elves, aren't they? And don't really do anything as good as either of them. Wood Elves are indeed faster, yeah. Oh wow! Could be a win for the Yogas! Yeah, Woodies are faster. Prone Wood Elves is there. The, pro, the Wood Elves are catcher, aren't they? The catchers are, are like stronger. 
Yeah, I don't love the Nos either, but they're still strength 3. It just takes so long to skill them up, doesn't it? Like, I prefer the strength 2 woodies, to be honest. But you see that path less taken, but wood elves get blodge leap, tackle, blodge leak strip, and catches with blodge, or rog. So... You know, yeah, exactly. That's the thing. Speed and strength. Yeah, on the Elf Union, you know. If you have four catches or even three catches and two blitzers, they do have they do have really good players. It's just they're min maxed, aren't they? Because they're linemen or like even though they're still elves, the linemen are like, why don't you just have plus one movement for ten k? Oh, what is even going on here? Yeah, Proils. Oh, yeah, yeah, and the thing, yeah, Proils do have the extra skills. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's fair enough. Thing is, if you go four catches and two blitzes, you can't protect them all. So that's the problem. You could even go two throw things, only 10k. Yeah, pro is, pro is tier two for uh, for NAF style, and Woody's a tier one. But Woody's and Dark Elves are tier one, and High Elves and Pro Elves are tier two. So yeah, I guess they would get the extra, and they would have more strength. They would have more skills. Turn out a ten steam review from because we can find decent. <laughs> yeah, but uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, in NAF style, they would get to start with dodge, but they, they would be having less block. I don't know. They're obviously better if they get more stuff, um, but is it good enough or not? That's the question. Two forty seven left. A historic win with August is on the cards, a hard fought. A hard fought victory, well earned. Sterling come back from one nil down. Against all the odds, beat our arch rivals, fucking Norse. Could happen.
Yeah, sure, sure, Inarian. We can have part two. Well, the good thing is, Jiranal, you can play in, NAF, in the NAF League and in the uh, and in Champs Ladder still, can't you? got no idea if the commissions can validate results to be honest no oh, yeah I guess I guess things I know in our own will score in too it's uh it's not a problem Three seconds. Yes, one with Ogres. Glorious. What a glorious victory. Deserved that one, I think. I think I, uh, think I played great to come back from 1-0 down there. Really, really fantastic play. Well done, well done me. <laughs> Like that guy got MVP, to be fair, he did. He did fucking get two cards, so he deserves it. I didn't get a double. Don't even know what to take, honestly. Break tackle's good, stand firm's good, guard's fine. <laughs> 